What's going on, everyone? It's Taylor Cowles here from CLNS Media, joined by member of the CLNS family, Brian Hines. We just got done with Gerard Mayo's introductory press conference to introduce him as head coach of the New England Patriots, 15th coach for the franchise, first black head coach in the franchise's history. Now, I will say my biggest takeaway from this was a sentence that Gerard Mayo said himself, he doesn't want to be Bill Belichick. <laughs> Clearly, he is someone who leads from a very different place. He mentioned wanting to make sure that people feel cared about before you lead them, get in all the X's and O's, and it was pretty clear that his leadership style is going to be very different from what we've seen over Belichick for the past 24 years. Brian, what were your big takeaways? Well, that stood out right away. I'm not going to be Bill, and you could see Mick cracking jokes right, yeah. right there, just complete <laughs> different personality, which we've got to know Gerard these past few years as a coach. You see that personality and a collaborative approach, and that's good. We've seen all these coaches, these disciples under Bill Belichick leave and try to be Bill Belichick mm -hmm. and establish that culture elsewhere and it doesn't work. So I think it's good that he's not going to be Bill Belichick. He said right away, I like to have titles, right? We haven't had yeah, titles on the coaching staff here in a, in a long time. And he said no disrespect, but that's just how he views these types of things. And mm -hmm. among that coaching staff, he says nothing's off the table right yeah. now. We've got a lot of reports. How is this offensive coordinator position? Maybe one of his biggest hires going to shake out. We've got some rumblings on who he's looking at defense special teams he said everything's still on the table right now so it, it was exciting to see and hear from Mayo that today yeah and he did mention in his search to fill out some of the jobs on the staff he mentioned that he wants people who are going to develop people that was his top priority something again in the Belichick era you don't really hear from that perspective in terms of building up humans it's really more about the football part of that I'm not going to paint Bill as like he doesn't care about people but really it's a very different tone for Gerard Mayo another thing that stood out to me was he was asked about the importance of being the first black coach in Patriots history. Now, Robert Kraft did say he didn't see color and that he wants to hire the best people, which not the best answer if we're being totally honest, but you understand where he's coming from and that when you are building a business, you want to make sure you have qualified people and you don't you know, necessarily discriminate one way or the other based on race. But Gerard Mayo, he had a different response saying that he does see color because he thinks if you don't see color, then you don't see racism. I think that is an important distinction to make because diversity is important in an organization and you know, I'm not going to get in some spiel where I'm trying to preach or anything. But again, it's a different perspective and a different voice for the Patriots than what we've seen from Bill Belichick. Now keep it locked on to Patriots CLNS. We're going to have you covered with any breaking news and updates. Keep it locked on YouTube, Twitter. We're all over the place. You can follow me at tkyles39 on Twitter. And Brian, where can they find you? At I am Brian Hines on Twitter. See ya.